Later this week, Cash begins his new job in the infamous Mangrove River, and soon attracts the attention of the next generation of River Boys, who are very interested to learn that there's a new cop in town. We've already met two of the latest batch of River Boys, as Rory and Dingo sprung into action to help Molly get revenge on the Allen siblings earlier this month, after they beat up his brother Aluka. Rory and Dingo didn't actually get involved in the conflict, as Molly's fight with the Allen brothers was soon interrupted by the arrival of Rose and various other cops, but it's clear that the Mangrove River boys are still a force to be reckoned with. While he made an interesting first impression on her by wolf whistling her from the balcony of salt, he soon won her over, and the last few Australian episodes have seen Flick fall head over heels for the charismatic bad boy, even suggesting they had away together for a few days. However, Rory and Flick's romantic beach walk was interrupted when Dingo tried to grab Rory's attention. Taking him to one side, Rory asked him well, how'd it go? Dingo revealed that he'd stuffed up, causing Rory to retort, how stupid are you? It's not hard, you pick up the gear and you go. To an oblivious Flick, however, the scene was just one mate consoling another, and she couldn't help but smile as she watched her new man caringly put his hand on Dingo's shoulder. While we don't know exactly what kind of deal Rory and Dingo were doing, the gang are clearly still involved in underground criminal activity, and Flick has no idea what she's getting herself in for. Cash and Rory have already met on a number of occasions, first when Flick happily brought her new fling back to the Saxon Avenue house she shares with her brother, and later at Salt. However, as Flick did her best to avoid small talk between her brother and her new love interest, Cash failed to discover where Rory is from and Rory has no idea that Cash is a former cop about to return to duty. A promo for this week's episodes revealed that Cash gets a river boy welcome later this week, when the boys notice that a new cop has arrived in their part of town. Cash and Joe have already worked together, after Joe made the move from Mangrove River to Yabby Creek Police back in 2022, but she's seemingly moved back to the notorious force since then. What do we do now? asks Dingo when the boys find out that a new cop has arrived, to which Rory replies, we welcome him to town. As Cash and Joe later step out of the Mangrove River Police Station, they find a message of welcome crudly spray painted across the bonnet of Cash's ute, as a gang of smug river boys sit and watch from nearby. Both Cash and Rory are in for the shock of their lives as they stare over at each other, and Rory's cocky smile quickly fades as he realizes he's just spray-painted the ute belonging to his new fling's brother. He's dating my sister, Cash later tells Joe after they head inside the station. My condolences, she replies. When Cash later finds Flick back in Summer Bay, he's quick to tell her to stay away from Rory, but refuses to explain why. I'm gonna need you to end things with him. Cash tells Flick. I'm just gonna need you to stay away from this guy. As Flick tries to interrupt with a half-hearted butt, Cash insists, Okay please, I wouldn't be asking you this if it wasn't important. Meanwhile, Rory spots an opportunity, thinking he can use Flick to get info on Cash. We have a unique opportunity to get some dirt on the new cop, he tells Dingo as they walk through Salt, clearly in no rush to give Summer Bay a wide berth after their discovery.